80 junior ROTC cadets no longer have a program at Seneca High School. WDRB's Molly Jett explains why it's ending. Molly? Many told us it was providing a sense of belonging for them. Thousands of students have participated over the years, but now the latest generation is left walking the halls without their uniform. Seneca High now has a room full of trophies and pictures, but no students. Gave me a reason to go to school. Katie Lawrence was in the program for one year as a cadet corporal. I was really sad when the program was dismantled because that meant that I wasn't able to do something that I really love again. The school's principal, Michael Guy, says they had no option but to end the program. We have nobody to fill the position. The Marine Corps ROTC program has been on hold since last fall because no one has shown interest in running the program. The job's been posted for nearly two and a half years. Anytime you have to take something away from uh, students, whether it's a handful or hundreds, it's really heart wrenching. Like, I really, really want to do this. Qualifications include having served 20 years in the U.S. Marine Corps, retired, and have an intention of teaching in a classroom. We've reached out to the Marine Corps, we've reached out to retirees on the Marine Corps list. We've had no luck. I can more confidently talk in front of large groups. For the majority of Calvin Cooper's high school career, this room was his safe space. Really enjoyed working along with all the other cadets and being able to help lead them through things or troubles they have in their life. Years of Seneca High graduates going on to serve. It has that foundation in its history and the, being able to, to be its last part in its last class, it, it's very important. Comes to an end. At Seneca High School, I'm Molly Jett, WDRB News. More high school also had to end its ROTC program in May, again because no one stepped up to lead the program.